one of the in 19th century one of the training in main training in uh, very respectful then um, organization called um, Golden uh, Dawn was to it was esoteric esoteric organization we were work, it was we were working on uh, you know soul development and catching informations and stuff like that organizing spiritual science into system actually yes so um, one of the practice there was to use that first tarot that was made with pa painting 22 fi pictures on base of playing cards was to take them and see where they lead you which is actually what we are going to do we will take the card and use it as a portal of course i will just okay it's it's maybe, maybe crazy when I say I will guide you, but I will guide the process and then you will know how to guide yourself through it. But I will, you know, just transpass it to you because that's my specialty. And then you will use it because tarot is for everyone. It's not like you want to be a tarot. It's for everyone, like cooking, because it helps you to focus and helps you to structure yourself and pa integrate parts of the soul not all soul, but parts of the soul that are necessary for some phase. So you're on the track and constantly aligned. Anyway, key practice in those in Golden Dawn was to take the car, use it in portal, see what was happening, and you know, uh, transmit, put that information into the card. And that is when kind of a uh, problem happened because some people who were doing that were. Um, actually possessed by uh, because of drug use and wounds and you know unclean uh, dark psychic territory was was, was possessed with um, you know demons and creatures that are not having that um, best human interest in mind and that's the point from where the correspondences tarot correspondences and uh, meanings come. Uh, other person m makes the cards and uh, puts pictures in it. She didn't do that with bad intention, but it was lately used badly because it's kind of programming. So main divergence that happened in tarot system is programming pictures with meanings. And it's similar to what happened to you know a lot of a lot of everything actually in nowadays with spiritual science so tarot cards don't have meanings but meanings re-emerge are every time different and they re-emerge every time this is why it's magical when you contact it you get every time a different information so we are going to do on that principle it's called like it's um, reading it's called reading cards french traditional method of reading cards but we're not going to read the cards we're just we're going to, i mean we will but we will know what is the point and point is changing the story and we won't do the meanings because they don't exist they change with every situation